I do not have a high hope of ever seeing my coins again. Seaside police say over $200,000 worth of gold coins were taken from Fenton Ward's home. My assumption is that they busted in this window and then there's a lock that holds it shut up here. They opened it and pushed it back out of the way and then crawled in through the window. Police are now looking for the two men who they say may be connected to this home burglary. We need to find out who they are because they were in the area when this happened. So they either saw something or they were part of the actual criminal act. So that's why we need to find out who they are. A nearby surveillance camera captured the moment the two men in a silver Jeep Cherokee circled the area. We left for a doctor's appointment at 2. Um, it was back by 4.30. They had come and gone by then. But apparently... Um, once they spotted the safe, they grabbed it and quit looking for anything else. Police say the suspects took off with a safe that had hundreds of gold coins and some jewelry. Nothing else was taken from the home. When your house gets broken into, that's a huge violation of your privacy and your security. It makes you wonder if you're actually safe. Police say they want to know if this was a targeted job. The house was obviously ransacked. There was things moved around, cabinets gone through. But the safe looked like it was the primary target which the coins were located inside of. Ward says since the robbery, he and his wife have forgiven the thieves and say they have a message for the people responsible. And by the way, I can assure you, I have a lot less anxiety about this than the guys who took it. Well, I'd like for them to get on a, a better path. Also be nice to return my stuff. <laughs> but I'd like them to get their lives on a better path because where they're headed is either death or incarceration. Reporting in Seaside, Leslie Duarte, KSPW Action News 8.